as a kid searching for that piece of chicken on that tray that went around during the festive season was always fun. Today I'm going to do a walnut chicken for you. Heat the pan on a very gentle heat. Sprinkle some sugar all across the pan. If you want, you could add some water, but I don't really need to. You got to take the sugar to about 130 degrees, which is a light golden brown. So I'm just going to leave that there. We're going to watch this gradually turn. As it becomes a golden brown, that's the time I'm going to add in the walnut powder. Gently swivel the pan, but do not stir the sugar at any point. So that's now at about 140 degrees. I'm going to be adding the walnuts right now. Keep the flame on a very low flame or shut it off. Add in the walnut powder. Add in some chopped walnuts. Give this a quick stir. Make sure the walnuts are nicely coated. Take a palette knife or a, or a blade and gently press it down. If you don't have a silk pad mat at home, don't worry. Take a marble slab, grease it down well with some ghee or oil and then pour over the hot mixture. Leave it to cool down before taking it off the marble slab. Just before it sets and is still warm, take a knife or a heavy blade and just shape the edges to it. This will make it easier to cut later. Leave that there, it will take about 15 minutes to set. There's nothing like fresh hot chicken during the festive season. If you like this recipe, take a moment to leave a comment and do subscribe to our channel, It's Hopping Chef.